Hey, Brad. Hey, what's up, dude? Oh, not a whole lot. I found an awesome game called 10 Million that I just, uh, we had to do an urgent TA plays for. I'm ready. Let's do this. It looks great. Yeah, so it's, it's a puzzle game. Uh, it's, it's very similar here. Let's go through the tutorial so everyone can see how it works. It reminds me a lot of Dungeon Raid, but I think I like it more. I, I love the visual style. All right, so you slide to create a match, and you match swords to attack enemies. You know, that makes sense, right? Right. So match these swords, do some damage to the guy. He's dead. So next dude, we're going to match these swords. Uh, four in a row does double damage. So magical staves perform a magical attack, uh, and the backpacks give you loot. And monsters can also give you loot too, but it's pretty rare. Okay. So kill this dude by matching. Uh, where's the match? Here we go. All right, you're sliding these blocks or swiping? Yeah, it's sli you can slide them up and down. So so you keys open doors and chests, and the chest can have items, gold, whatever. So this chest has two locks that you need to unlock. So I need to match two uh, keys, which I just did. Oh my goodness, man. And then, so now you can get items. So now I have a skeleton key, and the skeleton key will unlock two locks. So when I get to this chest here, I hit it, and it's open. Oh, so, so the it's kind of a shortcut. The, yeah, the timer mechanic here now. So where your dude is standing is like how much time you have left. So like right now he's in the middle, but as he stands there, like it scrolls, and when it hits the end, like you're dead. Okay. And like getting hit by a monster and stuff knocks you back. So that's like how your life works. Okay. So and you just you, know, you go just go as long as you can. Wow. So it's like an endless puzzler. Well, it's not endless because the timer kind of hurts you. So if oh, you yeah. match shields, uh, you gain the, the shield stat, which then when a monster hits you, you don't lose time. So like here, let's match these shields here. Now I have three shields. So when this dude, well, I killed him, but when the next dude hits me, it'll take that off. So then you have like wood and um, stone are like the junk tiles, but they're used to upgrade your castle, which we'll see after I, I do this. Okay. So, hitting, hitting swords. See, that dude just did six damage to me, which deleted all my shields, but I didn't move back six damage worth of space. Make sense? Uh, yeah, it's crazy advanced, uh, yeah. considering. So, and then, you know, like they're telling you, so keep moving, and like it's the, the strategy that goes into this is insane because you wanna you wanna clear wood and stone, but you only really have time to do that when you're moving forward. See, like when I'm fighting this guy, if I match wood or stone, it's like counterproductive because I need to be matching things to kill him. Mm. So I have to match like staves or swords at this point. I just don't have any matches because I was managing the board improperly. Right. So this oh, is kind wow. of screwing me up here. There we go. This game is blowing my mind. Yeah. So here's like the the boss dude that's gonna just kill me. Yeah. So that's the tutorial. So then you get your score at the end, as well as you get to keep the resources that you earned. So you see these little doors and stuff here? Like, those are what you unlock with your wood and stone. And right now, I have um, a thing that trains your guy, which is this. So I, I use experience to spend on these, you know, bonuses. Wow. So Wow. Head to my luck there. And then we'll go over to the blacksmith. I don't have enough gold to buy anything, but you upgrade your weapons and, you know, all that stuff there. And I have no idea what it's, what's behind the other doors. I mean, presumably, like, other bonuses. Right. So we'll do we'll do normal difficulty. Like this is where I'm at right now is vagabond difficulty. So you'll see what the game is like once you know. This is like an hour into playing it. So monsters now are getting trickier. Uh, I'm coming across better items. Like right now I have a scroll, and that uh, produces more staff item or er, blocks. And that okay. red orb I got does like a fireball, like a kind of direct damage thing. Oh okay. So. Like right now, I'm kind of stuck. Like there's no good sword matches. There we right. go. There's one. There, yeah, yeah. So you're just kind of eating it. Yeah, and when you do huge matches, like like four is double and five is triple the effect or quadruple the effect. I'm one or the other. So I'm not doing too good right now. So uh, hopefully things turn around. I'm just in awe. Like I'm literally just like drawn into the yeah, magic. So I'm gonna... using I'm using the orbs there to kill this fire thing because I'm gonna die otherwise. And let's see. Uh, that's my scroll. So you see all the like staff icons it pooped out. Right. Yeah. So, and that's it. I'm dead. This is the game. <laughs> wow. It's awesome, dude. I love it. So yeah.
Check it out. Download it. Tell your friend to download it. Tell them to tell a friend to download it. <laughs>